Hi, this is Pat Winter, and I'd like to share my design team project for Lost Mimi's Amour. And I wanted to share this love letter box. And this is of Rose and John, and it was found in an old cedar chest up in a dusty old attic in France. And when you open it up, Apparently, Rose had collected these treasures of hers, of her life, with John and placed them in this box and left a little note for her great-great-granddaughter to find. This is a, the brooch from her grandmother that she wore on her wedding day. And a piece of her wedding dress. And it's filled with all of these hearts. And I'm thinking they must be from either John to Rose or Rose to John. Not quite sure. And here they are on their wedding day. And this is a little note that was from John. He would always pick the little fresh little rose buds from her garden when he had to go away for war and business. It just says, Dearest Rose, I love you always, John. And that was one of her treasures. And this was her change purse that she kept the stamps in that she saved from John's letters. Oh, and here's some more hearts. And this is her locket that she always wore especially while John was away. And it's her and John on their wedding day. And this little bundle are some precious photos that she had saved through the years of her and John. more hearts and these are her most value, valued possessions which she had bundled up with an old handmade paper and a chiffon ribbon and they are the letters from, from John through the years They're just love letters. That he wrote to her and that she wrote to him. And that is what the contents of this love story box holds. And all of the, um, the hearts and the letters and the envelopes are all in, and the photos are in um, Lost Mimi's Amour, her Etsy shop, which I will post below. I know that was a little short demonstration, but I hope you enjoyed it. And I do have another little thing that I made with, with one of her digitals. I printed um, a, one of the letters and the photo of their wedding, or not the photo of their wedding, this is just them <clears throat> just enjoying each other. Um, and I printed them on tracing paper, and I used to actually do this for my sons, um, the kids in his classes growing up when I was home, or a room mother, and they're just little pouches that you can give out to uh, friends and family, you just, I know it's, it seems terrible that I'm ripping this, but they're so easy to make. And you just fill them, sorry for all the crunching, with little treats. So I thought that would be a good idea to share with you. 
something very easy and you don't have to sew them like I did. You can glue them. They work just as well. Put a little bow, personalize them. So I just thought that was a cute idea that you might want to whip up for uh, Valentine's Day or any day actually. Any little treat for a special someone. So thanks for watching and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.